Welcome back to the channel, guys. My name is Gordon Frain. What is going on with CDIS protocol? We're seeing a huge run up in price. That's what we're talking about in today's video. As always, if you enjoy the content, please make sure to smash that thumbs up button below, hit that subscribe button as well, and smash that bell notification icon if you wanna get notified about similar videos in the future. And don't forget to grab your free copy of The Rise of Bitcoin. It's linked down below this video in the description. Grab it while it's free. It is my gift to you, and let's get into the content. So, Cetus Protocol is a leading decentralized exchange on the SUI network. We've done tons of videos about SUI on the channel. You can and should check them out. I will leave links for them at the top of the screen. So, check those videos out about SUI. If you're not sure what SUI is, it is a layer one blockchain competing with the likes of Solana, Ethereum, Cardano, etc. And it is super quick, very easy to use, and we're seeing tons of protocols just like Cetus being built out on top of SUI's blockchain. So Cetus is actually the largest DEX by TVL on the SUI blockchain, and just look what's been happening with the price of Cetus over the past few days. What is driving this? Well, Binance, one of the world's leading exchanges, just announced here at the very point of around 5th November that they were listing Cetus on their exchange and we just saw the price of Cetus pump by 173%. So this is the type of stuff that still happens when huge tier one exchanges list smaller protocols and smaller tokens on the market. It means there's an opportunity for huge amounts of liquidity to much more easily flow into these assets. Remember, in order to purchase something like Cetus, you would have to use a SUI wallet, you would have to have capital in the SUI network, and you would have to use a decentralized exchange just like Cetus or Turbos or other DEXs on SUI to actually purchase Cetus's token. So the barrier to entry is much higher when you don't have tokens like Cetus listed on large centralized exchanges. So when something like this happens with Binance, you can see just the reaction of the price, firstly, because it's just a very bullish signal that a tier one exchange would list a token like Cetus, and secondly, because much more liquidity is able to flow into the protocol and into people speculating on Cetus by purchasing their token, and a huge squeeze to the upside is a result. You know, Cetus has had an interesting few months. We obviously saw a run up with the price of Cetus back in March when we saw Bitcoin reaching its all time highs and we saw many other tokens getting up to these type of, you know, local highs or 2024 highs before a big retracement throughout the summer and then lifting off again. So we got Cetus back above the 200 day moving average here by the 20th of September, spiking up as high as 23 cents before a retracement. And then on the back of the news, of the Binance listing, we've had Cetus going from prices around 17 cents all the way up to 48, 49 cents. So a big run up in price for Cetus, very bullish sentiment with what's going on. If you have not checked out Cetus before, you can find it at Cetus.zone. It is built for SUI and for Aptos actually. So you can come over to their decks and you can connect your SUI wallet. You are going to need to be using a SUI or Aptos compatible wallet connected to the Cetus decentralized exchange in order to interact with it and purchase different tokens. So again, if we've got SUI in our wallet, we can swap SUI for other tokens native to SUI. And if we're using Aptos, we can obviously connect and <clears throat> swap trade, uh, purchase and sell different Aptos network tokens. So again, some of these meme coins taking off on SUI, you've got Cetus's token itself, you've got Navex, Navi's token, you've got uh, wrapped versions of Ethereum here on SUI, Scallops token, a whole bunch of stuff going on within the SUI ecosystem is available for purchasing and trading directly on Cetus. And secondarily, you can also provide liquidity on Cetus. You too can be a liquidity provider and earn yield by supplying capital into liquidity pools for different trading pairs, and you can earn a very high yield. And again, if we look at this pool for Cetus and SUI, you could be providing part of this $7 million worth of liquidity, and you can be earning yield from providing liquidity here. You can see we're currently getting about 329% APR for providing liquidity at a concentrated level for this Cetus SUI trading pair 
on the CDIS DEX. This is the new world of decentralized finance. This is you being able to take responsibility and financial responsibility back into your own hands. You are now the bank. You can control how these DEXs work, how we provide liquidity, how we earn yield, and how we can earn passive income by providing that yield on these different decentralized exchanges. So lots of bullish sentiment around SUI and CDIS as a result of that. And just to put all of this into context, guys, we're now seeing that SUI is the eighth largest network by total TVL in the entire DeFi space. It has leapfrogged both Polygon and Avalanche very recently with these moves up in price, with more and more capital and liquidity flowing into SUI. We did see Circle, the company behind the USDC stablecoin, recently launching the fact that they're going to be natively minting USDC on SUI. That began a number of weeks ago, and we've seen TVL in SUI increasing as a result of that and very, very high amounts of liquidity continuing to flow into SUI over the past few weeks. Again, we can see here that CDIS is the largest decentralized exchange on the SUI network with about $236 million of TVL. It's only behind two separate lending and borrowing protocols, Navi Protocol and SUI Lend, and CDIS is the number one DEX. Again, look at this volume and the increasing TVL on the SUI blockchain for everything happening in DeFi over the past few months. A big run-up in at the beginning of 2024, going from $211 million in TVL up as high as $707 million. Bit of a dip off during the summer as we saw the price of SUI retrace, but going from levels around $300 million um, as recently as August 4th, up as high as about $1.27 billion where we are at today. So all of this liquidity flowing into SUI means that people need and want the ability to be able to swap different tokens, you know, make trades and see this as the leading DEX on SUI is the hub for that to happen. So huge amount of bullish sentiment around CDIS, lots of exciting stuff happening on CDIS's um, decentralized exchange. You can earn here by providing liquidity to pools. You can do farming. You can add capital into vaults. And of course, you can DCA into different positions if you wanted to be purchasing and giving yourself more exposure to not just CDIS's token, but also SUI's token. You can set up a DCA strategy to dollar cost average in and purchase a certain amount of SUI or CDIS or other, other SUI related tokens on a day by day, week by week, or even minute by minute, hour by hour basis. So lots of exciting stuff happening in this world of decentralized finance. Let us know if you want us to put together a price prediction video for CDIS. You know that we love putting together the price predictions, guys. If you want to see a price prediction for CDIS, drop a comment below this video. Let me know if you want to see a price prediction for CDIS over the course of the next 12 months. Obviously very exciting, the fact that we get such a parabolic move like this, and it's maintained huge volume throughout the course of the past five days. You know, we had this two-day run-up and getting all the way up to 38 cents, a small bit of retracement before going even higher again. So, you know, I think that bodes well for the fact that CDIS has built a very robust protocol. There's a huge amount of TVL. There's people using this, millions of dollars, hundreds of millions of dollars flowing through CDIS on a daily basis. It's very exciting to see. And as always, guys, today's video is sponsored by Femex, one of the leading centralized exchanges. It is the most efficient crypto trading and investment platform. I've spoken with the team at Femex. I know the guys behind it, uh, a very good group of people. Um, you know, obviously, we just talked about CDIS getting listed on the Binance Exchange. Uh, it has also recently been listed on Femex, so you can come over to Femex and you can search for CDIS. You can even see it in the new listings area here, and you can see that you can purchase CDIS directly on the Femex Exchange. Um, I am leaving a link down below this video, a referral link in the description. You can check it out. It is a referral link, full disclosure. Of course, this is not financial advice. Do this at your own risk. Um, obviously, volatile assets in the crypto space um, you know, can go up very, very quickly as we can see on the chart, but they can draw down and come back down just as quickly. So let the buyer beware. But the team behind Femex are a great group of people. CDIS is available easily on Femex for purchasing with bank transfer, credit debit card, 
um, whatever you want. Lots of simple ways to on-ramp crypto, sorry, on-ramp fiat to purchase your crypto. So check out the link below the video and head over to Femex. That is it for today's video, guys. As I said, let us know in the description below. Do you want to see a price prediction video for CDIS? Drop a comment. If there's enough comments, we'll put it together. We'll get the price prediction and see where we're going for the price of the CDIS DEX over the next 12 to 15 months. As always, if you enjoy the content, please make sure to smash that thumbs up button below. Hit the subscribe button as well. And if you want to get notified about similar videos, smash that bell notification icon. And once again, grab a copy, The Rise of Bitcoin. It's linked below in the description, completely free. My gift to you. Grab it now and we'll catch you in the next one.